Okay, today's a tire changing day on the Model A. These old white walls were just too old, too worn. I'm going with this kind of expensive $210 radial tire. It's meant to look like the old uh, Model A tread, but it's an actually a radial tire. I've got three out of the four done. I'm doing it. Uh, Doing it by hand with a tire iron, the way they used to do it in the old days. It's kind of a pain, but uh, it works. I'm getting better at it. This is the tool they use. So I got one last one to do. This guy right here is going to come off. What else have I been doing? The weather's been so crappy, I really touched this thing a while. I'm trying to get the, get it finished up so I can get it on the road. Um, one major thing I have to do before I want to drive it is... Um, it has no shocks on it. Um, the old Model A shocks, they used a, some sort of a glycerin oil in them and it corroded them. Um, so most of these old Model A's, the shocks have been taken off. You can get reproductions that look like the originals, but it's $1,200. I'm more concerned about uh, being able to drive this thing. It's never going to be a show car. So what I bought is a conversion kit to put tube shocks on it. It's a, um, these laser cut brackets and Monroe gas shocks. Looks like it's going to be kind of a pain in the ass to install, but I don't want to drive it without shocks. Ron Davis shock kit. It's supposed to be very good, but uh, it's going to take some time. I'm going to have to pull apart the rear end and drill into the front axle and all that to mount these things. After I get the tires done, I'm going to start on that. So. I think I'm going to start driving this on the road around May. Just trying to get everything the way I want it first. It's a new tire. One last tire to go. And um, i clean up this mess back here too. Took some time out to do this um, birdhouse and do a small uh, addition to the rake. Built up a little retaining wall here so we can sit out more comfortably this summer. This is going to be an all, all our flower garden. So I've added this guy, got the fountain going. Did this little wall. Brought some fill in. Got some seed growing. I'm going to put a little round table here. It's just nice to sit out in the summertime under the shade of the uh, split leaf maple. <laughs> 